What's going on guys? Welcome back to Fishing with Norby. We are out here at the venue again today. We're going fishing here a little bit. Stay tuned. But right now we are putting up rough cut lumber. I got all this, just got cut from a friend's sawmill. And we are cutting it right now, putting it up in the Groomsman Lounge. So, got our saw out here. We're just getting started going in the Groomsman Lounge here. And we hung some lights, painted the ceiling black. And we're doing rough cut lumber on the walls here. How you doing Gage? Good. Gage and Danny helping me today. But this is what it looks like before. We're going to show you the after here in a minute. Uh, we got the front room all done, flooring done, ceiling done, and walls done. All the paint done. So the only thing left we have to do, build a little partition for the groomsmen to change into their suits. But it's going to be the groomsmen lounge. It's going to be rustic. I'm excited. All right, guys. The groomsmen lounge inside major rehab is done. Check it out. Look at this. We got rough cut lumber up. The floor has been painted with masonry paint and sealed with a concrete sealer. Look at that. We're gonna be putting a bar top up here, bar stools, a couch, sweet rug. Big project. The Screams and Lounge was a big project. It was basically trashed, the whole place. We redid the whole thing and it's looking good. So, hope you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button for me. Subscribe for more videos. We're gonna get out of here. Here's What's up guys? We're back out here on Lake Gunnersville. If you didn't see the last video, catching crappie. Out here with Austin Campbell again. How you doing? Pretty good. And we smashed the crappie last time we were out here. Oh yeah. We smashed them. It's uh, cold days out here on Lake Gunnersville, but we're back out. And today we're focusing on white bass. We ran into some white bass last trip yep. and we're gonna try and catch a bunch of big white bass for you guys just to show you how live scope works catching live bass so let's get at them got it on the fold you got him there he is <laughs> there's one I'm just getting back out here to fish. Is that a... You were catching the whites this morning, man. <laughs> all right, let's see this, guys. All this bait right under us. There's a school right out here. I'm going to turn my motor a tiny bit so you can see it. There it is. There's the school we're casting towards. And we're just outside the edge of the bait. You can see the bait. If I look back, bait's all over the bottom. This is not... Actually, those are bigger marks right under us. See if we can get him. Get him? Nice. Another white. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you are on the whites. <laughs> Got one right under wow. us. Whitey. <laughs> it is a little whitey. Tiny. First small one of the day. Those are probably the ones that steal our bait every now and then. Right out there. Wondering if I can't. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to be on them. Stop it right there. Oh, oh. Coming right towards you. Yeah, it's about to be good. Oh, one's following it too. For whatever reason. There he is. Oh, he missed it. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Stole my minnow. Pulled down my, my jig. There's one. Yep. Big whatever it is. Dude, something big. <laughs> oh, it's a big white. Man, what a tub. Oh, he came off. No, he broke me off. Time to retie and I didn't. <laughs> I need that net. Yeah. <laughs> Dang. Broke me off. Little turd. Alright guys, so I'm going to show you exactly what we're putting on here. Get a little split shot there. About, I don't know, 15 inches up the line. I'm throwing on a little... You hooked up? Yep. He's hooked up. Throwing on a little bullet weights. One sixteenth ounce. Yeah? He's big enough, isn't he? Yeah. All right. Little nine, ten incher hooked up. Here, I'll throw him in the well for you. Look at that, guys. I just broke off on one. There 
there he is. Alright, let's get back to the retime before he gets another one. Good work, man. You casted that one? Uh-huh. That's sweet. Live scoping them. Right there. Right. Baby shad live minnow. I got one. I got one on the rod that was just sitting under there. Wow. <laughs> Big white. My rod almost went in. <laughs> Look at that tub of a white bass. Oh my goodness. They're so big out here feeding on these shed. I'm gonna throw this back down there real quick. You got a spot left? Yeah. Good work. All right, we'll rig back up, guys. Like I was saying, got my weight up here, my 16th ounce jig head, shad, Bobby Garland, paired with a minnow. That's what's doing it today. Where was the school at? There's one right under us it's another white man these whites break you off so often oh yeah they're feisty i think that's what keeps breaking me off yeah their gills are so sharp uh -huh. oh man this is a good one too they fight hard they're fun to catch still gosh they fight so hard when they're that size i mean we could be taking these home and flaying them really they're good eating but Look at that. Jeez. Loading up on them. Yeah, see, that's like a school I feel just so Really? Cool. Got one without a minnow. <laughs> the whites will eat anything, man. This one's fighting even harder. I don't want another white. I want another hair. <laughs> I'll let you, uh. Yeah, there's that school. Fighting harder than the last one. Yep. Jeez. Big old white. I feel bad bow flipping these with four pound test. They're so big. <laughs> Another minnow. That hit just like a big crappie. Feels like it. Yeah, it's a big crappie. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is amazing. It, man, he might be a white. Oh, it's a, it's a white. I probably need to retie, check my line. We are out here smashing them though, guys. Look at this one's eye. Oh my goodness. Check that out. Ooh. <laughs> That's a little little nasty. I I don't need to retie. I don't feel any nicks in my line. That's just the hatch. Yeah. That's what they've been doing today. Looks like crappie down there. Yep. No, that's definitely a white. <laughs> Way too big. They fight so hard though. <laughs> oh man, that's so fun. Big old white. What? Something that what? My wife? Yeah. Yeah. She really just loves bass way more than crappie and bluegill for some reason. I burnt her out. That's what I started her on. She caught too many. <laughs> She's been on the white bass, like loaded on the white bass with crankbaits while we're bass fishing. And she's like, get out of here. We've caught too many of these. <laughs> I'm just like, wow. But she loves to get on the bass, man. She's a bass fisherman. Yeah, it is. 
She she has patience, man. Oh man. There he is. Dude, he's so good. That feels like a white. No, it might be a big yeah, it's a white. Dang it. There we go, guys. We're loading up on them. I mean, loading up, live scoping, Garmin live scope. Crazy. Yeah, I think so. Dropping down in them. There he is. Yes. They're all following him, too. <laughs> A group of them. Wow, that's still fun. I just didn't feel like digging through my box. Big old whitey. Mm -hmm. Yep, pretty close to the boat. Yeah, doubled up. Doubled up. I love it. <laughs> Big white bass. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Doubled up. Good. Look at the size of that white bass, man. That might be the biggest one of the day. Oh yeah. Wow. That is so fat. Oh my gosh. Let me see the oh just kidding. <laughs> Big and ten and a half. Nineteen. For some reason my boat seems like it feels well no. There's one. Fighter. Man, these buy hard. Doubled up. This one might make be crappy. Yeah? Nope. <laughs> Don't let him get caught around that motor since it's on oh. spot lock. And he broke me off. <laughs> Show him the camera. Oh, just kidding. We we're doubled up. <laughs> it's all good. All right, guys, we caught a bunch of white bass. Did you have fun? Oh, yeah. Had a blast. We caught some thick ones, too. Those are good to flay up, keep, but I don't know. We got plenty of fish in the freezer. Oh, yeah. Got plenty. <laughs> plenty. So we let all the white bass go. They fight so hard, though. Had a blast out here. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you subscribe for more videos. Again, check Austin's channel out. Uh, links are what again? Uh, on Instagram, rods underscore always underscore bent. And then on yep. Facebook, check me out on uh, at Austin Campbell. There we go. I'll link those right there. You guys can check him out too. He's going to be guiding here before long, but we're going to get out of here for the day. God bless you guys. We'll catch you next time here on Fishing with Norby.